Hello boys and girls, Miss Gomez here again for reading and writing. Today is Tuesday the 28th of April. Um, like I said this week, we're focusing on fiction. Okay, so fiction are things that are not real, cannot, cannot happen. They're made up stories. Okay, so for today we have Mermaid. Okay. So mermaids are legendary half women and half fish beings who live in the ocean. Many cultures of the world have stories about mermaids. Some cultures believe that mermaids bring bad luck or are bad omens of things to come. Mermaids are associated with war warning sailors that they are about to wreck their ships on rocks. They are also known to fall in love with humans and help them if needed. Christopher Columbus and the pirate Blackbeard reported seeing mermaids on their voyages. They were not fascinated by mermaids and even avoided places they were thought to live. So this one's kind of interesting because there were some people that have reported that they have really seen them. So they're kind of like mythical creatures. Some people say they've seen them and some think they're fake. They're not real. Okay, so number one, remembering main idea. Who? Okay. Who did we read about? Who was mentioned in here? What? Okay, what happened? What are some things that you read about maybe the mermaid? Why? Okay. Why? Um... Maybe why did they do something in here, the mermaid, okay? Maybe something, name something why they did it or um, or why you read. Why do you, you think you were told, you had to read this, what was important about it? Number two, understanding details. Write three sentences about what you remember or learned. Number three, applying. Why did some sailors avoid areas where mermaids lived? Number four, analyzing. What good characteristics were mermaids thought to have? Number five, evaluating. Do you believe Blackbeard and Columbus came from a society that liked mermaid stories? Why or why not? Number six, creating. If you were a mermaid, where would you live? What would, what, would you help humans? Okay. For number six, like I said in the past, if you want to be creative, um, it asks, if you were a mermaid, where would you live? Draw, maybe draw um, of where you would live. Um, and like I said, be creative, add color in there, um, make it fun. Number seven, your opinion. What was the most interesting fact you learned about mermaids? Okay, so that is all for um, today. I hope you guys have a good rest of the day and I will see you tomorrow.